The purpose of this video is to explain how to mix and how to use BPC-157. Um, things you're going to need are your BPC-157. I have mine for my tendon regrowth and healing. Uh, you'll need a mixing needle, insulin needle, and bacteriostatic water. Um, you also want some alcohol pads because you don't want to get sick. First things first, take out the alcohol pad, swab the rubber stopper on both your bacteriostatic water and your BBC 157. Make sure you take the top off. There we go. Um, I've been talking to my doctor and we've decided that we're going to do um, 12 and a half days of two times a day at 200 micrograms. Um, the math we're doing for that is this is a five milligram little bottle of a BBC 157. So we are going to inject two and a half milliliters in there. Um, once this is dry, you can stick this straight down the middle to your bacteriostatic water, turn it upside down, and then pull out exactly to the number you're trying to hit. Once you are at the correct number for your dosage, you can put the mixing needle into the peptide. Now you're going to want to stick it and point it down towards the side so you don't denature your protein, like so. And slowly let it in. At an angle. Once we're good there, we can swirl it around until clear. And we are clear, and we are ready to use our BPC-157. Then you take your sterile insulin needle, open both sides. My dosing is going to be at Ten cc's. Sick needle straight down the middle of your BBC one fifty seven. Pull down to ten, and you are good to go. Now I recommend uh, having your doctor talk you through this. This is just a a little something to demystify the process of it, and um. You can inject it intramuscularly or subcutaneously. Uh, my main point of advice is talk to a doctor, talk to a trained professional, and have them run you through all of this. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me. Have a wonderful day.